Good Saturday afternoon to you from Steen Smokehouse. A couple months ago, Russ of Smoky Ribs, I'll include the link down below, had a hamburger contest, and it had several rules. One of them was you had to do it in a minute and a half. And I thought about a burger over and over again, and I came up with one I thought would be a surefire winner, except I was about a week too late for the deadline. So, I was thinking about that again today, and I decided, you know what? There was a place around here in, uh, in the Dallas-Fort Worth area that specialized in bacon cheeseburgers, and they were real simple, and they were really delicious. They weren't real elaborate. They didn't have a lot of fancy toppings. They were bread. They were meat. They were cheese. They were bacon. Thousand Island dressing. So today, I'm going to try to do that and see if it tastes just like I remembered it. So if you'll stay with me, we'll get busy. I'm going to use the slow and sear like we did on our last cook. I'm going to use a ballistic griddle on top of it. I've already made the hamburger patties, and I'm getting some lump charcoal fired up in the chimney. Okay, I've got our ballistic griddle in and our grapes. I'm gonna go ahead and clean them up a little bit after the grill heats up and I'll be right back with you. So while I was doing my Saturday shopping, I came across a hamburger press in the housewares department. I thought, you know what? That'd be really something cool we could have a steam smokehouse. I put it in the car and I walked around. I thought, you know, I think I can come up with something at home that's just as good. So I've got this old iron skillet that's been in my family for probably a hundred years. And now we've got our own hamburger press. I never used a griddle until I got the ballistic griddle and I, I endorse this. I think this thing's great. I love using it. I love watching the way the smoke rolls out from under the meat and with the lump charcoal underneath and the ballistic griddle uh, attaining as much heat as it uh, attains and retains, it's, it's super to cook with. It's almost like an iron skillet now it's getting so dark so if you haven't got one of these I definitely recommend it. Just for fun, I'm going to use our homemade burger smasher on both these. This is delicious. It's got enough of everything, not too much of anything on it. It's, it, it's really, really quite tasty. It's just real simple. Bread, bacon, meat, Thousand Island dressing, some lettuce, a couple of high quality buns. It's awesome. Try it sometime.
When you visit Texas Slabs, please tell them Steen Smokehouse sent you. I'd appreciate it. Thanks.